Movie buffs, welcome back to Fun With Films. In this episode of Fun With Films, we're going to take a look at the weekly pickups for last week. Normally, I do those videos on, you know, by Saturday, Sunday. I used to do them on Thursday, but today is a little late. It's Monday, so we're going to take a look at the pickups for last week, okay? So, it was three, um, three, three pickups. Um, one pickup from Best Buy, one from Goodies Disc Exchange, and one from a new place that's on the radar. It's called games and dvd exchange they're in media pa if you're in media pa you want to check them out they got retro games from they cover almost every generation of gaming just about they got some really rare titles in there they the rare titles are pricey as they would be anywhere some of the rare titles like metal gear ultra um i saw uh power stone for the uh, uh dreamcast um the marvel versus cap for the dreamcast um, some really nice stuff in there. Go ahead and check them out. Now, they have DVDs. Their DVDs are reasonably priced. They have dump bins for the DVDs. They're 3 bucks a pop. And their, their basic Blu-rays are 6 bucks a pop. Now, they have some specialty ones like steel cases, collections, and, and the harder to find Blu-rays are priced a little bit more, but still very affordable. Again, this place is called Games and DVD Exchange in Media PA on State Road. So if you're in the area, go ahead and check them out, especially if you're into the retro gaming thing. Their retro gaming selection is probably the best I've seen in the area so far. Without further ado, let's go ahead and take a take a look at pickup number one from Best Buy. I was in Best Buy this weekend um, replacing my router. Uh, my router took a dump and it was under warranty, so I went to Best Buy to exchange it. And I was walking past the movie section, just walking past, and I saw this. The Saw 8 film collection for $24.99. All eight films on Blu-ray with DVDs, so you're getting gonna, you're gonna get all eight films on Blu-ray, and then again all eight films on DVD, all in this one box for twenty four ninety nine. Now, it's packaged with these little you know with the little flip style. Now the first ones um, are all Blu-rays. This blue, Jigsaw is the end of the Blu-rays. Then it start the DVDs, and then when you do the DVDs. At the end, you'll see Jigsaw on DVD. So Blu-rays first and DVD second. All in all, a really nice set. All eight Saw films. Now, we watched one and two last night. And the transfer to me on one wasn't that great. It really did. I really couldn't tell much of a difference from DVD to this one. However... Saw two, you could tell that you could you could see the Blu-ray upgrade on two. I didn't watch any of the other ones, but maybe it's the way one was shot. I think one was shot in such a way that even on Blu-ray it wouldn't probably look too much better than DVD. That's just my my little two cents in that one. But this is the Saw eight film collection at Best Buy under twenty five bucks for all eight films on Blu-ray and DVD. Check this one out if you're a Saw fan. Next up, we're gonna do we're gonna save goodies for last. And we um this is a four film pickup from Games and DVD Exchange in Media PA. First up is a is a classic that I had way back in the day. And this is something that I really wanted to add to my collection again. This time it's on Blu-ray, baby. Twister. This was a fantastic film. Great effects, great story. Um if you come across this one, add it to your collection. Twister's a great film. It's cheap. You can find this. This is in, you know, like the $4.99, $5.99 bins all over the place. Here's one that I wanted for my collection. Since I saw it, I just never got around to it. That's precious. This movie right here is a, is, is an emotional roller coaster ride. Fantastic film. Um, for those of you who like Monique, Monique really showed her acting ability in this movie. I'm surprised Monique didn't didn't get more job offers for acting gigs after doing this movie. Precious. Add it to your collection, guys. And this movie is cheap everywhere, even on Blu-ray. You can find this movie. I've seen it as low as like four bucks on FYE. Here's one that I saw and I really liked. And I knew I was going to add it to the collection as soon as I saw it. Cheap. A Quiet Place. 
this movie was awesome really really good movie guys very different concept very different but it was really good and it's in great condition it appears to be brand new with the slip cover a quiet place here's one now for those of you who watch my channel I do a video showing you my steel books I don't have that many steel books I'm not a huge steel book collector but when I find steel books of films that I don't own because um, I really won't upgrade a Blu-ray, a standard Blu-ray to a steelbook. I won't do that. But if I don't have the film and, and the, the steelbook is at a reasonable price, I'll definitely buy the steelbook. Uh, Suicide Squad. One in the steelbook. Really cool art. You got your Blu-ray and your DVD in there. Awesome. This is an awesome little pickup here. What you got? Yeah, two discs in there. This is a great pickup for the money. I was very pleased to get my hands on this. Again, like I said, I don't go out of my way for steel books. But again, if I see them and I, don't, and I don't have the film, I'll go ahead and grab it. Or if I have the film on DVD, I'll definitely upgrade to, to a steel book if I can get my hands on it. But yeah, definitely. Now, there's some great um, uh, video collecting channels out there. There's a couple of guys out there who collect steelbooks, who have impressive steelbook collections. Unfortunately, that's not me. So, that was the four titles from Games and DVD Exchange. Next up is Goodies Disc Exchange. Now, Goodies is in Delaware County, just like Games and DVD, but they're on McDade Boulevard. Um, goodies, they are... Again, they like the mom and pops. They um, have a wonderful CD selection. If CDs is your thing, they have CDs. They have a great selection of vinyl. They have a great selection of VHS, TV shows. Um, they have all kinds of movie like uh, movie and TV show sets with little figurines and all kinds of little memorabilia. You got to check out Goodies. It's a small store, but they got a lot of stuff in there. So that's my shout out to my local mom and pop stores as I. Frank with more mom and pop stores, I'll shout out more. Um, first up from Goodies Disc Exchange is, this is one that I really wanted to see. It's got Eli, uh, Eli Roth in here, and I like him. This is called The Last Exor mm, Exorcism. Never saw this one. It's a horror film. I love horror films, so I said, why not? And it's got the slip cover, and it's in great condition. This is from Goodies Disc Exchange. <clears throat> Next up, this one caught me off guard. Now, you guys know I like Marvel titles. I don't really buy a lot of my DVDs or Blu-rays new. I wait for them to come out used so I can get them cheap. It's media. So, I'll let somebody else take the depreciation and buy it for 25 or 30 bucks, and I'll come around and get it for 10 maybe 12 And I found this one at Goodies, and it was in the new arrival section. I was surprised to see it sitting there. This is... Uh, Avengers Affinity Wars in beautiful condition with the slip cover. I had to have it. This is a really nice pickup from Goodies. Unexpected. I was surprised to see it. Next up is a, a Denzel film that I thought was okay. I saw it. But again, I'm a Denzel fan. You guys, if you saw my video, my uh, top Denzel movies, you'll know I really like Denzel and I will buy a Denzel film even if I didn't really care too much for it. And this one is Two Guns. It was okay. It wasn't as bad as Safe House, but it was okay. And I got this over at Goodies, and I'm pretty glad to have it in my collection, even though I thought the movie was just eh. Now, here's one that I just started to hunt for. I just thought it was weird because when I went into Goodies, I just saw it. I, You know, it's when you go into the mom and pop stores for stuff, you always will find a gem, something you might have been looking for. And goodies, I generally find something that I've been looking for. Now, here's one. I was going to order this online, and I'm glad I waited. Because, again, like I said, I'd rather, even though it, it all depends. Sometimes you might find them cheaper at your local mom and pop. Sometimes you might find them cheaper online. But I don't mind ponying up a few extra bucks to buy from the local mom and pop store. Even though this wasn't more, this was actually cheaper than online, and I was very, very happy to find it. And that is the director's cut of Das Boot. Das Boot. Uh, I have not seen it. I heard fantastic things about it. What made me want this is me and a couple guys at work, we was talking about 
um, one of my favorite Denzel films, Crimson Tide. And this just came up. I don't, I don't even know if they're the same. They might be the same type with the submarine and all of that, but it came up and I looked on YouTube and looked at some of the trailers for it, some of the reviews for it. And I said, yeah, I definitely want to check this out. But this can be pricey if you, if you are looking for this. It can be. I got it for a really good price and I'm very happy about that. From Goodies Disc Exchange, Das Boot. Now, let's take a look at everything. We're going to recap everything. It's a little hot down here, guys. I got the light on, no fan. So, let's go ahead and recap everything real quick. From Best Buy, the Saw 8 Film Collection. From uh, Games and DVD Exchange, Twister, Precious, A Quiet Place, Suicide Squad. From Goodies Disc Exchange, The Last Ex Exorcism, that won't always get me. Avengers Infinity Wars. Two Guns. Das Boot. Das Boot. So that's the pickups for last week. Uh, apologize for it being late. I like to get these things out to you before the week is out. But that's the DVD. No, actually no DVDs. That's the Blu-ray pickups for last week. This is Dave from Fun With Films. I'll catch you in the next video.